Hi everyone, I have my couch. So I'm in a new location and I just put it together. It is from the website Burrow and it is an internet couch company where you get a couch in a box. Uh, so yeah, it didn't take that long actually. It took maybe 30 minutes for me to put it together by myself, so no big. Anyway, we are here today because I have this package and I'm very excited. It is new hair for her. This is my Fairyland Feeple 60 Rhea and she needs a new wig real bad. This wig just gotta go. So here she is without a wig on and we're gonna fix that. So today I got two wigs from Monique Trading Corporation and they are the Monique Gold wigs. I have both in white blonde. I have the Rihanna wig and the Pretty Girl wig both in the size 8 to 9, so hopefully those work. I already own a Pretty Girl wig. My mini fee Celine wears it. This is just in a different color, and I really like that wig, so I want to see that one first. Perfect. <laughs> the sticker says Pretty Girl. <laughs> oh, this sticker also says Pretty Girl. Can you see where it says Pretty Girl? It says Purdy Girl. I don't know if you can see, but it says Purdy Girl 89 White Blonde. I really want to get a alpaca or a um, Angora wig, but they're very expensive and they take a long time to make, and I have not been feeling that patient. So instead, I thought I'd get one of these awesome wigs. I really like the ones my many fees have, so I thought I'd probably really like these. So let's take a look. Oh no. So I'm actually already upset because this wig, I mean I guess I could hide it with hair, so I guess it's probably not a big deal, but it has a big bald spot on top. I'm a little confused. I don't think my other one has that, or maybe I can't tell because it's so dark, but with this one you can tell there's like a huge bald spot. I don't know if you guys can see that. Can you guys see that? It's just like right here where my finger is. Yeah, there's a huge bald spot. Weird. Well, I'll try and make that work. Let's see. I'm actually going to take these wig stoppers off because I hate it. I don't like the way it makes it hard to take on and off the wig, so basically it's just this sticky velcro you can use that will help the wig stay on and it's just really annoying. But worth it I guess if your wig slides around. These look maybe a little tighter than the other one. Okay, let's see. Okay, so the color definitely is blonde and not white, but I don't hate it. I think eventually I might need to get another white wig because I really liked that, but this will do, and it's really soft. Um, so this could do. I don't hate this wig, and the um, bald spot disappeared, which is good. So clearly it's covered by other hair, so that's nice. So let me just comb this down. It is very frizzy though. That's the only thing. So perhaps I'll have to get a darker wig, I guess, if I really don't like the frizziness. But we'll see. This is pretty cute though. So here she is in this wig. It is also a lot of hair. I think a little less than the other one and it's extremely soft. And I don't know if you guys can see, it's a little bit like yellow white, because it's blonde. So, we'll try that one again. Maybe I'll like the other one more, we'll see. But I think I'm already liking this one a little better, because it is, it's softer, so the material is just not the same as the other one. It feels more like mohair. And then here is this one. So this one comes with bows. 
So we'll see if I like the bows at all, or I believe I could just take them right off if I don't like them. So this one is the Rihanna 8 to 9 72 white blonde color. Or perhaps I will like the ribbons. We'll see. Unless they fall off on me, as wigs are wont to do. I almost always destroy every wig I buy, so we'll see. Oh, this is a very different wig, and it's shorter as well. That's nice that it's shorter. Now, how do you do the bangs? They're very long. Okay, I guess you can part in the middle. Oh, this wig is... Oh. Hmm. This wig is interesting. It's choppy. It is short in the front and the side, and longer in the back. Interesting. I don't hate it, though. Huh. I can't decide which wig I like more. Well, I'll try them both on again. We'll try and figure it out. Plus, I think once I have the right wig on her, it'll help me decide what her name could be. You should also tell me what her name should be, so you can recommend names down below. Okay, this is very cute. So I styled it something like this so far. That's pretty cute, no? And then it's just kind of different lengths. That's cute. And actually, I like the ribbons in her hair. It adds a little something extra. The color is kind of weird, because it's definitely not a pure Snow White, which I was hoping for, but I should have known because it's called Blonde White, but you can tell it's not the same. But again, it'll do. And then maybe I'll get um, another wig down the line that's white. Or perhaps I'll buy another one from Monique Wig since I like them, but I'll see if they have like a white or white. Or I was toying with the idea of getting like a different color for her, so we'll see, but I sort of really like the white hair on her. So here is this one. So this is a cute option. Or there is this one. So I need to play around with it just to see which one I like best, but I'll definitely post on Instagram and try and figure out which wig I like best. I'm sure I'll use them interchangeably. They're both pretty good, so. We will have to see, but they're so, so soft, which I really like. I may see if I can find like a hair tie and perhaps I'll give her like a ponytail or a braid, probably not though, probably a ponytail. And um, I'll see how that looks on this wig. That could be really fun. So for now, that is my box opening of my Monique Gold Collection wigs. So I will talk to you guys soon. Bye everyone.